Hi guys, so I was shopping today with my mom. I took some time off after the new year and my mom and I planned like a big shopping trip. And while I was out, I bought a few things. I had some Christmas money to spend and I actually didn't buy as many books as I thought that I was going to. So that's good, I still have some Christmas money left over to go buy other things. But I did buy some books and we went to TJ Maxx. I don't know if you all have one of those. So I have kind of a collective haul from all of those places. I'm not gonna show you everything that I bought just because I bought a lot of house stuff and things like that. Um, but a lot of people commented or you know whatever about the earrings that I bought last time and I actually ended up buying some because they were having like a big clearance sale. So I'm going to show you things that I think you all would be interested in and I know a lot of people say this is in no way bragging when they do haul videos or Christmas videos and I hope that comes across in my videos that it's not bragging it's just um, you know, I work hard for my money and I buy things and I want to show you all I love watching your all's haul videos so anyway I'm just putting that out there because everybody else has been doing it. I've succumbed to the peer pressure. So I'm just gonna get started to show you the things that I bought at Half Price Books first. The first thing I got at Half Price Books isn't even something I bought. It, my mom bought this for me. It is one of those little aluminum wallets. And people use these because they say, they say it protects against um, like card fraud and people scanning it and getting your number. I don't know if that's true or if it helps or if the thing works or not, but it's really cute and it's kind of purple. I love it. Um, and she bought it for me, but the coolest thing is like I will a lot of times just grab my wallet out of my car or out of my purse and run somewhere so I don't have to take my whole purse if I'm just running somewhere quickly. So this is like super tiny, really easy to carry and the cards when you open it they just fan out like that. I think that's awesome. So I can see my library card, all my membership cards, my coffee card. <laughs> But they're all just right there so I can just pick this up and go and it'll fit in my pocket if I need to. I also bought this super old copy of Lord of the Flies. I've been wanting to read this. I hear that it's a great, terrible book, if that makes any sense. A lot of people say it's a really good book, something that you should read. They also say it's really hard to get through because of the subject matter. I've never read it. I don't even know a lot about what it's about. So, um, but I've been wanting to read it. It's a classic and I'm trying to work my way through a lot of classics that I should have read a long time ago. So I picked this up, it was $1.99. I picked up three movies also while I was at Half Price Books. The first one is The Devil Wears Prada. I love this movie. American Pie is on clearance for a dollar. I don't own this movie. I don't know why because it's so funny to me. And then probably mine and my husband's favorite movie of all time, The Goonies. It was a great book. It's an awesome movie. <sighs> I was born in the 80s, so, and this movie was made in the 80s, it came out in the 80s. I don't know, I just really, really love it, and it was only $3.99, so I had to buy it. Also, um, I was looking at calendars while I was at Half Price Books, but I didn't find one that I liked, but when I checked out, they gave me one for free, which was pretty cool, because I love calendars. And this one is called Read More 2014. It has some coupons in it and things, but it's actually a pretty great calendar. Each month sort of has a theme, like we're on January. So let me pull up January. January it has like a list. I don't even know if you can read this. It has like a list of all the books that you won't be able to put down. February has like the top 10 love stories. Um, it's just a really great book. And also on each of the little squares, there is an author or a famous person in writing for whatever reason, um, their birthday, there's the holidays, and anything in red is, in, is a half price books sale. So that's gonna come in handy. And there's coupons in the back. I don't remember if I said that. But this is a great calendar just for like my YouTube stuff and for my reading goals and stuff to keep track like that. So this was just a really great little, I mean, it was free. I kind of wanted more. <laughs> We also went to TJ Maxx. I don't know if you have one of those, but um, it's just this store that has a lot of home goods. And I bought something that's totally not book related at all, but I'm gonna show you because it's super, super cute and she is gonna live on my bookshelf. And that is this little guy, if you can see him, him or her, I haven't decided yet. Um, there's actually like some stuff that smells in there. I don't know, I'm gonna have to take that out because it kind of stinks. It's supposed to smell like lemon, but it smells like an old lady. But anyway, this is just a really cute little ceramic hedgehog and I think she's gonna live on my bookshelf. I love her. I think her name is gonna be Penelope. I'm not sure yet, but she's pretty cute. She jumped in my cart. She wanted me to take her home. We stopped at Bath & Body because they're having a huge sale and sorry I bought all the crinkly. But I only bought one thing and it's called Pink Chiffon and this is just the body splash. It smells really good. I only bought one thing at Bath & Body Works. How often does that happen? My camera's getting ready to go dead, so I have to go really fast. Um, last time, a lot of people really liked the um, earrings that I showed them. I bought three new pairs. I bought this pair, if you can see those. That's the first pair. 
I bought this pair. These are kind of, I don't know why I bought these. They were $3.99. All these were $3.99. They were on sale, but I don't know. Those aren't something I would normally wear, but I liked them. And then I got these green, which I'm not thrilled with the color. I don't know if you can really see it, but I thought with my hair being so dark that that would look really good. Okay, and then the last book that I have to show you that I picked up today that I am the most excited to show you because everyone is talking about it, everyone's been reading it, and I have decided to jump on the bandwagon and read it myself, and that is The Ocean at the End of the Lane by Neil Gaiman. I've never read anything by him, and you guys, I paid full price for this book. I couldn't find it on sale anywhere. I paid $25 for it. I don't think it killed me because I'm a bargain shopper. But everyone says it's really good, so I'm hoping that it was worth the $25. I think a lot of you guys who have read it will say that it is, but oh my gosh, I've loved the cover. I've wanted this book since it came out, but I just thought, eh, you know, I'll get around to it. But then everyone talking about it really made me want to go out and buy it. I'll probably read this one after I get done with The Coldest Girl in Cold Town, which is what I'm reading this weekend. So, um... Yeah, and it's a super tiny book. Everyone says it reads really quickly, but it's packed full of all kinds of good writing and great just stuff. And I hear it's really creepy, and I don't see what's going to be creepy about it, but I hope it is. I love creepy. So, yeah, I cannot wait to pick this up. And that concludes my collective haul. I hope you all have enjoyed. And let me know if you want me to leave out the other crap, or if you like the other crap, like the earrings and the home stuff. If you like that, then let me know. Either way, so that way I'm giving you all what you want and what you like to see. And I will see you all later, and hopefully I can get my book buying under control because it's out of control right now. And um, so I'm going to try not to do another haul until February. <laughs> Keep my fingers crossed. And I will see you guys later on. Bye.